Mr. Speaker, I rise today to recognize and honor two young men who gave their lives in Vietnam 55 years ago. Marvin E. Galbraith and John Timothy Lane were friends who grew up in Brewster, Washington as the Vietnam War broke out. Both, both graduated from Brewster High School and at the age of 20 in the spring of 1968, each found himself in combat in Vietnam. Lance Corporal Galbraith served with K Company, 3rd Battalion, 7th Marines in the I Corps region of South Vietnam. On March 27, he was killed by a landmine while on patrol in Quang Nam Province. Marvin was laid to rest in Bridgeport Cemetery with five generations of his family. Private First Class Lane deployed in the Mekong Delta with B Company of the 4th Battalion, 9th Infantry Manchus of the 25th Inf Infantry Division. On May 4, he was killed in a night battle near, near Duc Hoa when he threw himself on an enemy hand grenade in a brave act to save his fellow soldiers. In recognition of Tim Lane's courage, he was posthumously awarded the Distinguished Service Cross, the nation's second highest award for valor. He was buried at Locust Grove. As Memorial Day approaches, I want to honor the lives of these two young men from Brewster who, who heroically sacrificed their lives for our nation.